You already know what time it is. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Visual back with another episode of The Wolf Among Us. I ain't talking this time. Let's get straight into it. You guys been showing mad love on the other videos. I think all of my parts of this game has passed 100 views, which is like, that junk is insane to me. So I appreciate it. Before we get started, make sure you go ahead and like the video, subscribe, hit the bell, wherever that is. I think it's somewhere, somewhere over there. Just hit it for me. Appreciate you. Let's get into it. What up, Biggs? I forgot where we left off. Oh, yeah, we're in this chamber. Heard you. All right. How y'all doing? Y'all good? What's the vibe? Everything recording? I went through hell in the last recording, y'all. I promise you. I do better. So we're trying to find out who used that glamour on Snow's body. Oh my God, that is filthy. It's a common occurrence, like what? Wow. I didn't this is realize weird, exactly. I've never seen her face before now. This is weird. Yeah. Seeing her glamour face. is so effective, it's invasive. But just do what you need to do. Oh my Lord. Can I talk to you? Nope. Love you. Check her mouth. There might be a ribbon in there. Like before. What? Anything? Nothing. So I'm wondering Can if they use glamour on that other girl mouth? too. <clears throat> Thanks. Man, I'm so happy you're still alive. You don't understand. That's weird. I don't wear a brooch like that. Maybe it really belonged to her. Not part of the glamour. Looks mm. like something from the homeland. Interesting. Buffkin, do you recognize these symbols? No, nothing I've I mean, seen. I mean, I touch my mic before I lose all my audio. My fault, Buffkin. What'd you say? Nothing? All right. All Looks good. just like Faith's did. But there was nothing in her mouth this time. Do you think it was done by the same person? Absolutely. Did Dr. Swinehart ever get back to you about Faith? No. He said he wanted to run more tests. Oof. What are we doing? Rope marks. She was tied up? They tied cinder blocks to her ankles. Oh my god. So she would sink. sink. That's crazy. Oh. <coughs> Track marks. She used Monday drugs. Looks that way. You know, I didn't realize this game has too. such a dark undertone I to it. Here they only go for the legs if they've used up. I the can see why people are interested. Arms, or if they're trying to hide the marks. Wait. If the glamour is supposed to make her look like me, shouldn't it be concealing things like track marks? What do you mean? Brooch too. Why would it change everything else? I've never uh, seen one this sloppy. It's possible it's designed not to. Designed not to hide track marks? Good point. Oh, the yeah. That's stupid. know what they're doing. That's why they cost so much. Unless someone is making glamours illegally? It's not technically illegal, miss. It's Talk not encouraged, me. for sure, but there aren't any laws specifically forbidding it. So there's some sort of black market for glamours? One would assume so. I imagine anyone with access to the proper books and training could theoretically produce a glamour. <sighs> Yet another thing to worry about. Black market or not, it's a pretty good match. Look at that. The buttons aren't exact either. There's an extra one here. It's faulty. You're right. These buttons are wrong. A faulty glamour, maybe? Wonder. What? Wonder what? Right. I need to open. Yeah, let's ask. Of Snow, course. do you mind if I uh, open her coat? How are you just gonna do it anyway? Be, just let me do it. Oh my God, 
It's not you. You still okay? We're making progress. Let's, right, let's see, continue. See I don't have to baby find. you. You're a grown woman. I... Well, I certainly hope you're behaving yourself up here now that you're done punching people. What have you found out? I'm not finished, bro. I haven't finished yet. Well, get on with it then. I'm, go I'm going to smack time here. The killer stupid might be sideburns have an old dude, speak. bro. I promise you. We should keep going. I like the jersey. Shout out my people at school. Lingerie, neck mark, pocket, pocket, pocket. There's something, it looks like something's in this pocket. What is that? Parfum. It's your perfume. Oh. How did you know what perfume I wear? You can't fool this nose. <laughs> Looks like someone picked it out for her. <clears throat> so, someone gave her instructions. Or she already knew. Was that Victoria's Secret? Are you wearing silk lingerie snow? Why do you want to know? I'm just trying I to see know. if the clothes are exact. They're not. I think I'm gonna have to do an ex inspection. I can't go up there. All right, let's continue. I've seen things like this before. Relax. It's definitely magic. The witches don't usually craft objects these days. I don't think it's wise to fool around with that. It's I don't think it's wise for you to be here. Magic. Who knows what it could do? We should have it looked at. Just to make sure it isn't dangerous. Yes, yes, please Will shut you up. Keep quiet. Wait. Huh. What? There's something in here. How do we open it? I can't stand Crane, bro. I can figure it out. Might want to stand back. Yeah, stand Might back. Might want to stand back if you're worried, Crane. I'm going to try to open it. <clears throat> something to do with these rings here. I'm being petty to him for the rest of the game. Hello? What? Ah, uh -huh. little matchy match. Is that like a cat? I need the back body right there. Yep. Bring the tail down. Beautiful. Let's go up. That's a deer. I said a cat. Relax. A Chill deer. out. What does that mean? Oh. Lock of hair. Let's look at the photograph. Is that her? Someone must have taken this from my apartment. I noticed it was missing, but I didn't think this was the last picture I had of Rose and me. My sister and I don't talk much anymore. Interesting. Lock of hair. Let me guess. It's my hair. I have no clue who this, like, suspect yeah. could be. Like, I really don't know. Unless it's Crane, but I feel like that'd be too easy. Or is it Snow? I'm gonna shut up. I don't know. Who did this, Big Pete? Somebody did this. She's a troll? You gotta be kidding me. What the hell? I don't have nothing to say. Hey, somebody Who else say she? something. Been talking all game. That wasn't there before. Who do you think she is? I don't know many trolls, I'm afraid. Should have left them Maybe all back Holly in the knows though, yep. Holly the Maybe girl at the Holly at the bar. Knows. The owner of the trip trap? No, she looks a little She's a troll. Oh no. What is it? It's not Holly, it's her sister Lily. She was reported missing, but I, I guess it just slipped through the cracks. We have to go tell Holly. Right. Who knows? She might know something about this. Who Lily was seeing. Well, certainly another troll. How the subtitles look? Hopefully go. they're big enough. You can't go out there. This should be strong. Why not? It's too dangerous. Someone tried to kill you. Bigby, you can't let her go out there with you. 
You'd be putting her life at risk. Bigby oh is not gosh. in charge of me. He's in charge of this investigation. That's not the same thing. Yeah, it's up no to her. to come with me. I'm not going to stop her. But we should leave now. You ready? Oh, that yeah. was a that was a decision, y'all. <sighs> She's so fine. Oh my god. Anyway, I feel like her coming with us is better because I know where she is at this least. This whole thing is complete bullshit and always has been. I don't I mean, trust what's Crane. his job, really? I probably trust him the absolute from least out the of everybody. Ones. Jack, I don't know where they are. You're a bar. You're supposed to have darts around. And I normally do, but who knows where the fuck they went to after. Yep, it's time. Ah, uh, step on it. Come on, Holly. I need entertainment. What's this? This'll do. Thor? You can. I'm, I'm saying you can relax. Okay, okay, I know. Just relax. I'm not here to start anything. You get know, scared okay. the second I walk in. You know Miss what time White. it is. Miss White, I heard you had kind of a strange morning. It's been kind of a strange morning for everyone, I think. Every time I see this guy, he seems to lose weight. It's amazing. It, it really is. He loses weight and yet somehow keeps all the muscle. Jack. <laughs> Wolfie, my dear, how are you? Jack. That is definitely Thor from Love and Thunder. Because, right? you know, we were just talking about you. All of us. At the bar. Here. About you. I, I just need to talk to Holly. Privately. All right, just give us a second first. I'm dying to hear about the body that came out of the East River this morning. It was a fable, right? Oh, Ooh. everyone knows. <laughs> you saw Snow's face in the background? Here. That's hilarious. You said it looked like Snow White. What the hell, Crane? Sorry. Tweedledee said you arrested him for no earthly reason. Kept him locked in the cellar all fucking night. He said you tortured him. What? Which, I don't know, that seems like a breach of your legislative duties. I Baby, punch him come on. Like twice. You can't be so dumb as Jack, find the off button now. What is it with you two? You and Gran are all, let's get a posse together when there's no one around. But as soon as the big bad wolf walks in, your tails go between your legs. Cat got your nerve. What happened? What happened? <clears throat> I'm tired is what happened. Tired of what? Of trouble, Jack. I'm sick and tired I'm staying of, out of this. I don't want any more. I'll let them so argue. just stop revving his motor or wait outside or fuck the hell off. I don't care which. Sex. Bigby, look. Two fables are dead. And shit, Gren's sister... Holly's sister. Holly's sister has been missing for what? A few days now? Out. Just let him talk. And we haven't heard word one about it from anyone. They're already scared of me at Actually, this point. Actually, have there been any updates? Uh... On my sister. Nah, let's be direct. Holly. Your sister's dead. Let's She's the right. one we found early this morning. You shouldn't be that surprised, Holly. It's your sister, man. Boy, I sure walked into that one. If you say one more fucking thing, just one more thing. <laughs> God fucking damn it. Of course, the dear princess, Snow fucking White, is all safe and sound. Bro, I already Where were you when once. we Don't reported please. this weeks ago, huh? Where are you when we ever fucking need you? If you'd give one ounce of a shit about her, about any of us, she might have been safe. She might have been cared for. She might have been... The hell? Give her some room, right? Give All her right, some room. everyone. Clear out. I ain't leaving her with you. No way. <clears throat> Come on, somebody talk to me. I feel washed out. Hold on. I see this happen in real time. Holly. Get the fuck out of my bar. I just want It should have been you. 
Whoa. It should have been you, and it wasn't. She's just upset. It's all good. It's understandable. She's grieving. You didn't mean that. You know you didn't. We recovered this from her personal effects. I thought you might like to have it. I... I didn't know she still had this. The copper was from a dwarf mine. It's I'm staying out of this. Rare. Silence is sometimes the best option. Telltale said it, not me. It's quite lovely. Grin. Yeah. Take off for a bit, would you? Exactly. Are you sure? Grin and Thor. Built like guardians of the galaxy. Get out the freaking bar. I don't know that much about her life. Honestly, we didn't talk often. <sighs> she was lost here in the city. She just got swept away by it. I don't know. That's these these options are good. Let's let's you ask her this. Any idea why she'd be glamoured as Snow White? What? Oh God, I'm sorry. Talk. That was probably about about. She was hooking to pay down debt. It ain't me up to see her that way. Eventually, the only people she owed were at her work. You know that shithole club, the pudding and pie. And that one, that one girl, Fiona Georgie, at the beginning. with all this fucking. She was a prostitute too. It's a crock of shit. That's how they kept her under their thumb, really. Interesting, y'all. Interesting. Holly, it, it's okay. If it's too much, we don't have to do this. Let's ask one question. Sir. What kind of fees? Sounds like one of those old company store kinds of ploys. Right. Designed to exactly. entrap people by keeping them in debt. <clears throat> we can probably learn more at the club. We've got a lead. Maybe we can take it from here. <laughs> Lily. Let's ask one more. Yeah, yeah. She can tell us. I don't think so. Like I said, we didn't talk much. That's all right. You've been more than helpful. For real. Is she? Where is she? She's at the business office. She's taken care of. I'm gonna have to go down there and get her. Fuck. Please, we can handle the funeral arrangements. No, no, it's it's a kind of... It, it's a formality with trolls. We burn our dead by sunrise or... I don't know. Some uh, old shit yeah. Fuck your soul. I don't know. Of course. Okay. <laughs> Good. Let's go down to the business office and start making the necessary preparations. All See, right? my thing is, I mean, I kind of did a random selection. But we kind of got all the evidence we needed. We know who she is. Took everything that off that we needed. I'll go down there now. See She's what I can find out from the owner. You were good with her. I'm impressed. One step closer. Really? To the Thanks. cheeks. It just made everything easier. Let's get into it. Dang, I really left that there. Tough. Who cares? Systems. Achievement unlocked. I'm so paranoid that my mic is going to unplug that I lose all this audio. I'm telling you now. I'm retiring if that happens. The pudding and pie, the Bronx evening. <clears throat> Y'all about some cigarette smoking ass people, bro. Put them down. Oh, Sheriff, what a nice surprise. I'm not sure I've seen you here before. You're always welcome, of course. Oh, come on now. Appreciate Is it business you. or pleasure? Or both? I'm a friend Old of phone. Georgie's. Where is he? A friend? <laughs> I shouldn't have You're lied. in luck. He's here. Come on. Okay, don't matter. Who is that dude in the background, bro? No. This isn't my... Th Never mind. I should warn you that Georgie does not like to be bothered when he's working. And he's in kind of a... <laughs> I don't care. It's hilarious. Should I say it, y'all? I mean, more so than usual. 
I don't much care how he feels about it. <laughs> I can see why you're friends. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Welcome to the Pudding and Pie, where we cater to the diverse tastes of the Fable community. You know, Lily, your skip pleasure the show. is our pleasure. Your desires are our desires. Your imagination. I ain't gonna say trendy. nothing just yet, cause and I don't know who this girl is. is our guarantee. Right. Whoa. What do you think you're doing? You look like you're trying to take a shit. Who's gonna want that? No one's gonna want that. Uh, you yeah. fucking dozy bitch. I can take it from here. Am I gonna have to blur that out? Oh my gosh. It's your face. You have to smile. You never smile. How many? Oh lord. Oh, it's you. Why would it give me the option to walk around? Keep dancing, you! I didn't say stop. For fuck's sake! You! Stay right there. Don't even think about sitting down. We're not finished. I got let's a few let's questions. straight to the chase. Imagine my excitement. What do you want, then? You here for a little taste? Tell you what. Come back after midnight, maybe. I can hook you up. Or, uh, knowing you, this is probably not quite your style. You'd prefer someone who can take a bit of a beating. Tell me, do you prefer a stationary target or one that will put up a fight? Watch, 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 I'll be quiet on him. Like he ain't gonna know what to the do. the right price. None of that, George, eh? I'd rather just strike a <laughs> macho pose for a moment. <laughs> Jesus, Big B, you're so corny. I love it though. No, <clears throat> seriously, I love it. Can we cut to the chase? Okay, all right, Sheriff. Just fucking with you. Look, I know why you're here. Yeah, do you? Are you sure? Listen, Sheriff. Around here, we can't afford to wait for you and your swanky pals to take an interest. <coughs> we have to look out for each other. When shit happens, I hear about it. Especially if it concerns my livelihood. In that case, I assume you knew Lily was glamour. Of course she was, you daft git. She was a troll. One no, second. I mean glamour to look though. like another fable. Yeah? Well, so what? Who gives a toss? People get up to all kinds of things when nobody's watching. Right, there you go. It's their Go's own on. business. Is this some great strategy to get me to incriminate myself? Brilliant. This is exactly what I would expect from a thug like you. Storm in, throw around a bunch of accusations, try to scare people. I haven't said a word. What is he talking up. about? And we're all just meant to jump any time the wolf shows his teeth. He used to be something, you know. I ain't gonna show now him Now look nothing. at him. Anyway, even supposing she was doing a special glamour, it wasn't for me. I don't need the trouble. For who, then? Exactly. I don't know. She had clients. Maybe one of them was into it. A lot of fucked up people in Fable Town. Like who? Try looking in the mirror. Uh -huh. That was good. Anyway, now what to do with me? Go on, then. We're not done here. I think we are. I said we're not. You're gonna hit me? Go ahead. That's what you want to do, right? That's what you came no. here for, right? Nope, that's exactly that's what, what you want. Right. Oh no, fuck! What? You! Take your sad fucking face where I can't see it! Bloody bastard fucking shit! You proud of yourself, mate. Proud of your little mess. What are you talking about? I didn't do a Fuck's single thing. 
got Wreck It Ralph in this. Hans, is it? Hold on a minute. Hans, is it? Hans just cleans up and provides a little muscle when we need it. He's not going to know anything about the girls and their clients <coughs> or any of that. No one knows. Don't you get it? It's by design. Discretion is our guarantee, right? And the way we guarantee that is that no one knows anything they don't have to know, including me. I cover my eyes and take my cut. End of story. Why not look it up? What's that? Isn't what there a mean? little book with all the stuff about the girls and all that written in You're it? You're a fucking moron. The book of fables. There is, that, is, is that what no you're talking about? book. And as for you, Hans, we need to work on your communication skills and have a fairly good idea where to start. Hey, that's my personal property. Yeah, just tell me about the book. <laughs> See, they expect sure, me to be the ahead. big bad wolf. Do what it's comes not naturally. Tell me about the book. You haven't got the slightest clue. <laughs> that was about lame. Anything. I'm not gonna lie. Hey now. I'm not causing no rap. Cut the crap, Georgie. I want the book Hans is talking about. Hans is confused. Again. Don't even think about it. Just tell me where it is. Look, Georgie, why don't you just tell me where the book is? Can we please not go round and round about this? There's no book. End of story. Do not touch that. You hear me? That's nothing to do with you. I'm consistent. There's still you know, time for you to just cough it up. There's no I'm reason sorry, for me to be. But there's all no aggressive. anti magic book with everything you want to know jotted down inside. I sincerely wish there was. Maybe it would get you off me back. Mm, foolish. Well, well, what's this? Looks like a floor safe. <clears throat> I wouldn't know. It was here when we moved in. I don't have a key to it. Sheriff, will you come on? Fuck's sake, I've got to open up in a few hours. <laughs> what is that artwork? Give it to me. You're a big bad bastard. Horse. We get it. Everyone's guilty. We fucking get it. Jesus. You're killing me. I'm begging you. I'll pay you. People are dead. They're giving me a lot of options dead. to destroy stuff. And quit being a bloody idiot. Come on, mate. Leave it. There's nothing there for you. Let's do a threat. You might want to stand back. All right, all right, all right. See, I'm telling you, y'all. Don't need to be super aggressive. That's exactly what they expect. Bloody come on, man. So I'll just do the opposite. Prick. Even when I was torturing that dude in the last episode, I should have should have stayed Once completely again, on his side. Or at least it's not aggressive. Tell you anything, but it's a kick to the balls for me and my club, so we can be happy about that. Dang, I didn't see what it said. Here, this is Lily's last entry. So tell me, Georgie, who's this Mr. Smith? Oh dear, I'm afraid it might be a fake name, Bigby. Big Secrecy B. is sort of how this all works. Even Hans knows that. What's 207? Room number? I don't fucking know. Millimeters, maybe? Don't bullshit me, Georgie. This is your book, your girl's. I'm not their fucking secretary. <laughs> I give them a stage, I give them music, I provide an erotic venue to attract and retain clients. But let's be clear on something. The girls make the arrangements with their clients, not me. The girls. They're the ones with the Mr. Smiths and Joneses and Mr. X types. Whatever happens outside the club, that's on them. I log the business, take my hey, cut, and I'm out. Like now. One second. All right, let's continue. My fault. I've had quite enough of you and your bullying. Excuse me while I call your superiors to make a complaint. A complaint? What What could I have possibly have done? Hello? Business office? 
Yeah. Or G. See, this is why I'll punch him. Georgie. Third time's the charm. I got to. Georgie. Georgie. Lame. All right. What else is in here? I'll take your money. Yeah, that's right. You don't need to steal unless fifty-eight. Hmm. I want to talk to the deputy mayor. Do I have the book? I do. Can I, I can't look at it though. I don't give a rat's ass about that. Just fuck off and fetch him for me. All right. Fetch him for me, all right. I'm exploring everything. No, I don't want to. The walking with the keyboard is so like. So fine, I'll hold. All right, Georgie, shut up so I can talk. The walking is terrible, essentially. Anyway, let's go. <clears throat> Stick lip gloss, compact, glitter. What's that? Like a ticket or something? A note. Faith, thanks for covering for me tonight. Let's talk before you go over to the apartment. Mm. Lily. Okay. Looks okay. like they both saw one of Lily's clients. Nothing this way. Excuse me. I heard you out there. I don't remember ever seeing you here before. Somebody else said that to me on the way in. I See, but notice I wasn't surprised. being aggressive, so there should be a level of trust now, right? I would think so. You're trying to place me. What? They used to call me the Little Mermaid. Once upon a time. Are the legs a glamour? Does that do they help? Call you now? What do they call you now? Whatever makes them happy. My name is Nerissa. Well, Nerissa, I've got some questions. Of course you do. I don't have answers. You'll have to find those yourself. You'll have to talk to me a little bit more than that. Mr. Smith, 207, Lily last night. Did Let's you see Lily last night? You know, where she went or who she was with? You got we that can't answer. Talk about work. What? This is a murder case. I mean, can't. These lips are sealed. Discretion is our guarantee. Please, people it's keep saying that you here. disappoint me. By design. People keep using those phrases. What does it mean? This is what I need to know about. Lily's last entry. Who's Mr. Smith? Where's room 207? So just ask I have all the to know. Anyway. I'm not These mad at it. Lips. Sheriff Wolf, would you like to make an Oh, uh, there must be like with me. There must be like magic to where she literally can't say it. Yeah. Okay. That's what it is. What would I need to do? I need 150. It's not good to be short. Okay. Oh, I, uh, I don't, uh...
Wait here for a second. I'm picking up what she's putting down. Hold on, let me all right, let me look at some of these book of fables real quick. Everything's still recording, beautiful. All right, there's a lot of new things here. Let's look at, who is this actually? Jack Horner, harmless trickster. Don't care about him. No. All right. <clears throat> the Little Mermaid. Nerissa's story had never had, Nerissa's story never had a happy ending. She's known as the Little Mermaid, the little young girl who gave up her tail for a pair of legs, blah, blah, blah. That's nothing for real. Clever hands. Bouncer, janitor, handyman. Georgie the pimp. Takes pride in his nightclub. Doesn't react well to anyone meddling in his affairs. It's not too much information on these. The witching well. <laughs> That's so funny. Uh... Uh, it's home to a group of witches and wizards. They use their powers to keep the community hidden from prying mundy eyes. But all magic has its limits, and every spell has its cost. Bigby's mercy. What? In the days leading up to the Exodus, the Big Bad Wolf hunted armies of men and goblins in the Black Forest. These invading forces have driven off the great beast's preferred quarry. And their own flesh was rotten with corruption, hardly a suitable replacement. He made it his game to destroy their camps, devour their night watchmen, and disrupt their supply trains while sparing their prisoners. One day he broke the ranks, discovered a particular woman they held captive. Her skin was white as snow, <laughs> but her hair was dark as the night sky. He approached her, and knowing no sword, Master John will power, barely poison, and yeah, but do, 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 nothing really there. Let's get out of there. Let's get back to the game. Just wanted to read a little bit. Chill out. What's that? Not 207. <clears throat> You'll think of something. The open arms. Hmm. This is where they met. Enjoy your stay. I hope you find what you're looking for. Uh, what what would have happened if I would have had enough money? Is that a thing? Does anybody in the comments know? Could I have had enough money to pay her? I was rather peaceful. <coughs> oh. Hello? You just gonna walk past Sheriff like that? All I get is this? Hotel. This must be the hotel. The hotel -y. The Open Arms Hotel, the Bronx. <clears throat> so I got key 204. Don't care about that. Yeah, let's look at the, oh, that's just the phone. Keep your pants on, buddy. You have to check in first if you want a room. Damn it. So come on, mosey on back, and we'll get you set up. Are you hiding? Why can't I go upstairs? What's going on up there? Oh, uh, you. I work here, okay? I work the front desk. It's to help pay rent. So now you know. I mean, I don't I care none I about that. Should you should tell somebody, Beast. But Beast would lose his mind if you knew. Beast is a proud man, Bigby. He <coughs> wants to do right by me, and he he just yeah, couldn't handle it if he knew I had to do this so we don't get evicted. All of our friends live at the Woodlands. He'd be mortified. Well, your secret's safe with me, all right? Let's not make a big thing of it. Right. Thanks, Escorts Bigby. New York in the background. And That's funny. thanks for covering for me last time, too. Come on, now it's me. So, what That's are you what doing I, yeah. here? 
Oh, you have a key. Someone else was murdered last night. I heard. The victim was someone who worked at the Pudding and Pie. Lily. She, uh, come around here ever? Oh. Oh, yes. The, the troll. I did see her. Is that Clementine's voice actor? Wait a minute. I mean, you know, we never really spoke, but that's a million percent she came off a tad intimidating. Ah, fire. Do you know Faith? Do you know Tweedle D? Ever see Lily with anyone? Have you seen Snow here? Ooh, that's Have a you good seen question. Snow White down here. <coughs> or maybe somebody glamoured. That's a good her. question. You know, it's funny. I did see someone who I thought looked a lot like her, but she didn't say anything when she saw me. Even though she knew that I saw her, that's definitely I just assumed Clementine, it yeah. wasn't snow and went about my business. Uh, let's see. Do you know Tweedledee? Did you Ever know meet Faith? A girl named Faith, or just maybe hear that name? I might have. I don't know. By the end of the night, it's it's kind of a blur with all the names: Tara, Brandy, Amber, Heather. Sorry. All right, that's it. I don't care about the other two ones. I'm not gonna pry too much. I don't want her to feel like It'll I'm interrogating. Be if anyone sees you, that they at least see you with me, so they know that I didn't let you just wander around by yourself. Five minutes, please. We'll see, beauty. Just be ready to act like I'm trying to kick you out. That won't be hard. Hmm. Can I get a fresh set Listen, of towels? Listen, baby. I assume you'll be filing some kind of an official report or something. Which is fine, it's just that I was wondering if I need to be in it. For what? Do you have to mention my name? I mean, it's it's not like Beast would ever see your report. It's just, well, you never know. I gotta tell the not truth. much of a report if I start picking and choosing which facts to include. Exactly. I see. Exactly. Well, you gotta respect that. Which one was it? It was 204, but... Do y'all hear that, bruh? <laughs> I'm definitely listening, bro. You have keys to these rooms? I thought you had a key. Not to this one. Hold on, Big B. I can't just let you go into any room you want. I mean, what if someone's in there? You can't just go barging in. It might be I'm important. investigating a murder. I've got to check out all the angles. Oh, I need to Never check out all the angles. Significant. Well, I guess. <laughs> oh my god. Hey, hey, what the fuck? Sorry. <laughs> Jesus Christ, you're gonna get me fired. I need this job. All right, let me stop playing around. Sorry, yeah, yeah. Sorry, Sorry. about that. Let's apologize. I fall, beauty. They shut up quick, though, didn't they? I got, all right, so I got the keys to this room, but the, the one in the booklet was 207. <clears throat> Personally, don't know how much I need this one for. Uh, let's examine the desk. Never sure why they have desks in a place like this. We can examine the bed, but it looks terrible. Get health inspectors through here very often. I don't know. What do you think? Urgent. Finding what you're looking for. <coughs> I wasn't expecting much in here. But isn't this why you're here? Why you have the key? No, the key was just to be sure I found the right hotel. This isn't the room Lily was using. Trust me, I already oh. know what time it is. I'm just making sure I'm covering all my tracks, you know? Just covering all my tracks. That's why I had to go check to make sure the other two people so make sure they we weren't. Done now? No, the room they met in was 207. You're getting glamoured, all right. Talk to beauty. You don't really have to stay up here with me. 
Yes, I do. Just do what you have to do. Beauty, calm the attitude, please. Well, I turn to the beast. Mm. Uh, let's just go ahead and. Two oh seven. Open this one. Oh, oh, the well, music. That's weird. This key <clears throat> is supposed to open every room in the building, but it's not working. Beauty. Ah, shit. Beast. Big B. How could you do this to me? Oh my God. No, sweetie, no. Wait a minute. How could you do this? We've been together through everything. I took care of you. I love. It's not what you think. Please. You're cheating on me! With him? No, no, Beast! I promise I'm not! I'm helping him, that's all! I'll bet! Oh, Lord. I'm sure you help each other just great! I'm on this a kid. This is a murder investigation. She's helping me- Stop lying to me! What the fuck is wrong with you? She's my wife! Beast, Can listen you, like, to listen? me! There's nothing going on! I'm <coughs> Bastard! I guess I finally see you for who you are! Stop! Stop it! Is this you staying out of it? I don't want to hurt thought you. Just I talk to your trust wife. You. Listen yeah. to your wife. Just calm down and... Beast! Calm down. Ah! Oi! Nice. What the hell do you think you're doing? I've had a quick time in a minute. Alright, let me tee you up. You aren't even listening to me! Easy. <laughs> My hair is cute. Nope. 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 I told Here. You. So right. Hey, don't. Hey, right. come on. Oh my God. Yeah, make him look like the bad one. Oh my god, I ain't gonna do all that. Nah, you're good. You're good. Can I dodge? You ruined everything! She's my fucking wife! I'm not about to hit him, bro. Thank you. Thank you. That's all I needed. <sighs> Shit. What have you done? Bigby. Look what you did to the door. You can't just act like this whenever Stand you- Stand back. You, you don't want to see this. Ooh. Good goodness. Stay outside. No. Shit. Shit. What is it? <clears throat> oh my god. Don't touch anything. Is this- is this? Lily met her client here, Mr. Smith, whoever he is. And then. Dang, I wish I wouldn't have gouged his freaking eyes. God, Jesus. Last night? Yeah. I was on shift last night. On shift? Beauty? What? I'm not a prostitute, you idiot. I work Who the front desk. This room? I. So that's. Yeah. Still. Ah, uh, let's see. No let's do this. no place for someone like you. I mean, look. Was anyone acting suspicious? Maybe moving a heavy piece of luggage, or uh, he got the body out of here somehow. Jesus Christ! No, no, I didn't see anything like that. <laughs> it just seemed like all a I hear is Clementine now, man. How That's is so that funny. even possible? There's so much blood. Go lock the front door. Keep people out of the hallway. I need you to be sure no one comes in here. This is a crime scene, okay? But just do what he says. Right. I'll explain later, okay? Big goofy boy, watch out. Bigby, what kind of a person could do something like this? That's exactly what I'm about to try to find out. Yep. All right, let's examine the blood. Looks like she was lying down <clears throat> and she was. Killed. That's a lot of Flowers blood, though. Right here. How do you know that? Something in the blood closet. pattern. Also, I'd say the body was dragged off the foot of the bed. There. The body, Jesus. You could say she. Poor girl. I just can't even imagine. Alright. Can, can I speak to Beauty? I can't believe this. 
Why don't you go outside? Anything else you can tell me? Better not be hiding anything. How do I find out who? How rents can I the find room? out who rented this room? Find whoever has the key. I'm pretty sure this one must be held long term. And we don't keep a register or anything. This place is intentionally kind of anonymous. I keep hearing that. Keep hearing a lot of things, bro. <coughs> Boo. Someone's been rough with this dress. It's torn. Oh no. She must have been wearing it. He killed her and Dog. then and then he took it back off? Oh no. No, there's no blood on it. It must have been torn some other time. Alright, what's this? Cassette, ashtray, bottle, storybook. What is that? It's a book about Snow White. Or about the Monday version of her story anyway. What is the Monday? What does what that is mean? It? He made Lily wear this dress. He's into fashion. Uh, la, 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 la. The dress in the closet is the same as the one in this picture. I think Smith was dressing Lily up in it to recreate the snow from the book. You're right. It's the same dress. I guess he wanted to get the details right. God, role playing as a person who really exists. <clears throat> we know. That's just weird. I'm not sure who to feel worse for. Okay, what? no. I take that back. I was about, like, what? What are you talking about? The whole book is about her? Yeah. What does that say? Fuji? Red Delicious Empire? Why is she breathing? Why is she in a glass coffin? This is the part where she's in a deep sleep, but they think she's dead. Hmm. Oh no. What? What is it? He's obsessed with death. Bed matches the coffin. He likes people helpless. I think he marked this page because he <clears throat> likes the sight of a helpless person. It's about power for our Mr. Smith. He likes to be in control. So he's fixated on snow, but he likes them helpless. Maybe that's why he needed a stand-in. Oh my god, that poor girl. She couldn't have known. She probably <clears throat> just needed the money. She could have been anyone. How did she wind up here? I mean, not exactly here, but just how does a person... We can't know that. Yeah, we don't need to assume. Every situation is different. Yeah. All right, let's get out of there. What she else? She must have been so Apple? scared. Do you smell something? No, just apple. <laughs> huh. Oh no, there's more? What? What now? Clementine, can you please chill out? Murder makes him hungry. She was eating when he attacked. It's like the apple it's in the It's got book. a single bite taken out of it, like in Snow's story. Mm -hmm. Oh no, do you think it was poisoned? It wasn't. I'd have smelled that. I think it's just a prop. It's here a role because they were was acting out the scene in the book. Of course, that makes perfect sense. And whoever the dude is he's made... He's just acting out another part of the book. God, I'll shut up because she's on top of having trouble processing all of this. This guy has some kind of weird snow obsession, but then there's this other stuff too. Apparently he enjoys helpless women. That's not going to bode well for anybody. I hope you're just about through. I don't really want to stay in here any longer. Sorry, Clem, we could leave. Never mind. In the loop. What? Are those pictures of the dead girl? Not all of them. How do you know? I'm in this one. It was taken last winter. Oh no. Bigby. This kind of stalking, it doesn't just stop by itself. Trust me, I know about this firsthand. He'll keep trying to get closer and closer. Is that a mirror? His stand-in for snow is gone now, so... The next what was that shot? Closer. 
What is it? It's <gasps> Crane. It. What did I? What did I say, bro? I knew it. I knew it. Y'all can't say I didn't call it. Is that the end of the episode? I called it. He could be after you now. I called it. I literally called it. Good. I am dying to get my hands on that. Can I skip this? I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't like seeing. Good. I don't, I don't like seeing the next timeline. Oh, I can't. Whatever. We're watching. Really starting to like you, Sheriff. <laughs> Not afraid to be a complete bastard. Obviously, there will have to be some changes. So, Lee? Hello, Big B. He's going to die. Take care of it, Big B. Or I'll take care of it for you. Jesus Christ, Big B. Is that you? That didn't give us much, so I guess I'm not mad at it. All right. How did you respond to Crane about Snow's death? You and 60 players sympathized with him? I tried. Now I hated him, though. How'd you treat the murder? You forced him to talk. Beautiful. Good plays. Did you let Snow come with you? Of course we did. How'd you handle Georgie Porgy? You and 70% of players didn't hit Georgie. I really thought I was doing something. Did you keep punching Beast when he was down? You and 8.9% of players never had Beast at your mercy. Yeah. I, did, I, hand, I handled that flawlessly. All right, y'all. That's going to conclude episode two of The Wolf Among Us. This That episode was fire. I ain't going to lie. And I knew it was Crane. Or at least that he had some tie into it. That picture, he literally had. He was. I don't have to act it out, but y'all seen it. Disgusting. Disgusting. All right, hold on. Let's look at what episode three is called. Let's get a sneak a sneak peek. Episode three, A Crooked Mile. Doesn't give us much. All right, but if y'all did like the video, make sure you like, share, and subscribe right now. Do all of it right now. Wherever it is, I don't know, but I'll see y'all in the next video. Love y'all. Peace out.